Hey there, it's Charlotte from the Mac Observer. I thought today we'd have a guided tour through Apple's podcast setup, both on the Mac and the iPhone. I'll probably stick more to the to the Mac just because it's a bit more screen real estate to demonstrate on, but a lot of the principles apply on the iPhone as well. So first of all, obviously you have to load up the podcast app, which you can see the logo for there in my dock. Uh, and then you get a whole variety of options. The best place to start if you don't know what you want to find is the browse tab here. Now, there you can see there's all different featured collections and uh, different featured podcasts that Apple is recommending to you. And there's some also new ones here. Obviously, the, uh, these will probably be affected by your location, maybe some other stuff you've subscribed to and so on. You can also see down here, there's a whole load of different categories that you can start digging into and picking some shows to try out from. But if, so you could say, I want to listen to this episode here with Idris Elba, the Intelligence Squared podcast. I tap on that and simply tap subscribe at the top. Now, that show will appear... If I tap, tap on the Shows tab on the side, you can see it is in my collection of shows. Now, if there's a, a specific show you've been recommended, you can go back to any of the tabs. I'm in Browse at the moment, back where we were. Uh, you, can, you can type in the name of a show you want. So obviously what you should type in is Mac Observer. And there you can see... Mac Observer's Daily Observations comes up. So you should tap, tap on that. All the different episodes come up and you can, of course, click on it and subscribe. If you go, I'll tap on this back arrow here and you can see there's other different um similar shows that are also recommended so if you kind of want to find shows in the same thing so you should of course be listening to Matt Geek Gab so you again tap on the name press subscribe and if you have time to listen to other podcasts that aren't from the Mac Observer maybe you want to listen to Ken Ray so again tap on the name tap subscribe and then if you go to shows all those shows that we've now subscribed to are there. So you can see the Ken Ray one, there's T uh, TDO, uh, and Matt Geep Gab is in there as well. If you want to see what episodes are popular and what shows are popular, so you might subscribe to them, get some big names, if you go to Top Charts. these uh, This is again the UK chart, so these are the shows that are doing the best in the UK. I could... Tap on that and again, subscribe to it should I want to. If you get fed up of a podcast and want to unsubscribe, again, go into shows where your episode, where, where the shows you are subscribed to are. And then you can, I'm sorry about this, Dave, just for a demonstration, of course, you should stay uh, subscribed to Mount Geek Gab, but you can go to tap the three dots there and press unsubscribe. You can also delete all the episodes you may have downloaded from your library. Now, just a little another explore. You can tap on the show's name and see any of the episodes. And if you want to listen to it offline, you can press this little cloud the download button and it downloads and it'll be on your Mac. And of course you can, all sorts of options for sharing, saving an episode or removing it from your podcast library. As I say, a lot of it's very similar on the iPhone. So if you just tap open the podcast app, first of all, you'll notice all the things I uh, I just showed you how to subscribe to are already there. So, you know, Mac Geek Gab, um, the TDO and so on. But if we want to find another show, again, there's the browse tab, lots of different options tap them and tap subscribe at the top and you can search for specific shows as well 
So I tap in background mode. And then John Show comes up. I can tap that and tap subscribe. Obviously, I got there with the search tab in the corner below. Uh, again, within the I iPhone app, you can go to your library and see all the different things you have subscribed to and show and the most recent editions of the show as well. Uh, and if you want to download a if you if you want to download a show because you're going somewhere without signal, don't want to use your data again, simply tap the cloud icon, the download icon. Hope you found this useful. Do subscribe to the channel, leave your comments and I'll see you all again soon.